Hi, today I want to talk to you about something. Now this is what I based my DIY heaters off of. Now the reason I didn't show this at the beginning is because when I created the heaters, I created them so you could actually make them at home with stuff a lot of people or most people already have. Um, this is a purchase item. Now this is what is considered to be a stove heater. And you can tell it's nice and red hot. These generally run about $12 or up. $12, $12 up. Now it will put out a lot of heat. I can feel heat out here. Unlike the DIY heaters, which mostly puts out all the heat through the top, this will also put out some heat around the outside. I can feel that warmth here, and of course, it's hot up top. Now, I do have this on high. The difference is between this and the homemade heater with the foil is once that can, if you're using the can or just the foil itself, it doesn't take as much to heat that up and keep it hot. Now this is metal. If I turn the flame down, it's going to start cooling down some. But I wanted you to see this. Now like I said, if you want something for an emergency heater, something like this is fine if you have a stove. Either a propane stove or a butane stove. Something like that. It's fine. They work good especially for small areas. Now, I would not try to use something like this to heat up inside an RV or even a camper trailer or even a camper van. That is way too much surface area that's open to try to heat up. But, if you need emergency heat and you have a small stove, butane, propane, doesn't matter, and if you have a double burner stove instead of a single burner, you can actually use two of these on a double burner stove and put out more heat. If you are wanting to buy something, now these run anywhere from $12, $11.99 um, or to up on eBay. Now this is a camp stove heater. So if you want to buy something to put back, Something like this is fine if you have the fuel. But once again, you do need fuel. Now you can see my flame is all the way up. The stove is all the way up. And you can see it's nice and hot. And it also comes with this to actually move it, pick it up and move it. The ideas for my stoves, not stoves, excuse me, my heaters are based on this. Now they say you can cook on the top of this, but you probably could. I mean, it's plenty of heat coming out the top. So once again, you don't want this underneath, directly underneath something. Um, the heat's, I can still feel it about there, and it's, it's warm up here. But as far as heat coming out the top, the DIY heaters, with the foil put out more heat through the top but this will put out more heat through the sides so if you're going to use this in a small area make sure there's nothing really around or put some type of heat shield around this to keep yourself safe now, I do feel the heat on my arm here but once again this is on high so let's turn this down to basically where I had my other heaters all right right there's pretty close it's still a little bit high compared to what I had before with the DIY heaters now still putting out some heat but not nearly not nearly as much so whatever you want to do is fine but if you want some type of emergency heat, now even on low, a lot of stuff is coming out the top. And even on low or just beneath low, 
or minimum is putting out heat. So in a bad situation, if you have some type of closet that you can empty and you can sit in with you, maybe someone else, and have this in the closet with you, now remember to make sure you have air coming in and some air going out. This will help keep you from freezing. Even on low, it's putting out enough warmth. I can feel it probably, you know, I can feel it there. And it's warm. But out the top, it's so-so. I mean, here it's, it's hot, but, it, you know, I can keep my hand here without an issue. So if you want to buy something for an emergency, something like this would come in really handy. But that's up to you. Like I said, these things run uh, like $11, $12 or higher. Um, I believe I paid $11.99 for this when I purchased it. And the reason I didn't talk about this is because you do have to order it. You know, you can't just build this at home if you need emergency heat. But if you want to get prepared, you can purchase something like this for a severe emergency. All right, I am fixing to go. This is a um, camp stove heater or stove heater. And that's it. I'm fixing to go. Once again, uh, these run about 12 bucks or higher. That's all. Um, everyone have a good one. And this will be the absolute last video I do on the heaters. Once again, you can buy one like this or you can make one yourself. Um, I'm fixing to go. Everyone have a good day. Bye.